My name is Taylor, I'm 16 years old, and I've been attending Willow Huntley for five years. I've gone to church my entire life. I can't remember a time in my life where I wasn't attending at least some type of church. And I kind of got disconnected for a few years. It was just like a personal preference, I guess. Like, I just didn't really like to go, I don't know. It didn't seem like it was for me at the time, and I wanted, I would much prefer to hang out with my friends or something on a Saturday night and then sleep over. So I just kind of stopped going and like, things just started like slowly, things started to like go downhill for me. I had a lot of problems with my friends. I was always kind of the one that was picked on. Last year got really, really bad. I hated to go to school. I didn't want to do anything. And my mom kept trying to get me to go back to church. And she was like, I really think you should do this impact thing. Like, I hear a lot of kids like it a lot. And I was like, no, I just don't think it's for me. I don't get along well with, like, I just don't fit in easily with other people. And so I was scared to try something new because I was scared of what was going to happen. I kind of prayed during all that. I tried to, but I never really know what to say. I would just say like, God, why are you letting this happen to me? Like, why would all my friends just turn on me like that? Like, that's not fair. I didn't do anything. But then on my birthday last year, I decided to go to church. And a friend of mine, the first thing he said to me when he walked up to me was, hey, you should come to Impact. And my mom had been trying to get me to go for a really long time. And I was seeing the relationships everyone else had with the people at Impact, and I kind of wanted that. I met Allie Peters, and she was really funny. And like, so I don't know. I just wanted to get involved. They just all clicked really well. And when they saw each other, everyone got so excited to see each other. And I was like, man, that like looks like a lot of fun. I don't know. Maybe it would make going to church fun. So I decided to go. I just had a lot of fun. And I decided to go back the next week. And then I decided to go back the next week. And I think I've missed maybe one or two weeks for vacation since last June. My life has changed drastically. I finally found a place where like everyone accepted me for who I actually was and wanted to get to know me and wanted to hear my story. I finally feel like I fit in somewhere. My name is Chris Watson. I've uh, been going to Willow Creek Huntley for close to four years now. Growing up in a Christian home and, um, you know, was always uh, involved in church and youth group and went to a Christian high school. I knew for a lot of years that um, I could feel God kind of tugging on me to get more involved in things um, and always just kind of pushed it aside. You know, wasn't really ready and I don't know if it was me not being ready, or uh, I felt maybe if I did get involved, it wouldn't be good enough. For me, where it really hit me was uh, my first trip to the DR. It was like, okay, you know, I'll take a chance, I'll do it. I think it'll be something for me to try. And I remember the first day uh, walking into a home and looking at it and going, I can't believe that people live like this. And um, I was just overcome with emotion. And, you know, I remember specifically having to walk away from the site because um, I was in tears, thinking, um, you know, my gosh, I have it so good. And these people don't have anything near what we have, yet they're all happy. You know, and just think, like, I complain about <laughs> some of the rough patches we have here. It's nowhere near what these people put up with, the impact was um, incredible. I came back from that trip knowing that I had probably opened a door just by participating. I think that was really where I connected and felt like, okay, this is what God was asking me to do. And after that trip, I got uh, involved with our Compassion and Justice team here, um, helping out with the local ministries um, and just, you know, we started small with some things like food drives. You know, we started doing food drives and then came up with the idea of partnering with Habitat for Humanity and had the conversation with Habitat and they were super excited to partner with us. And we're doing our second house now in Huntley and the volunteers keep pouring in. Um, so God, I think is kind of showing me, hey, maybe this is what I've been asking you to do for a long time, you know? and. It's almost like, okay, you know, God, where, where's the next thing you need us to do? 
Um, and when the prompting comes, we just say, yep, open the door and walk right in.